All right, here's part three on our demonstration of some section view techniques. This time let's take a look at some partial sectioning techniques. I'll zoom in on this view up here. If we wanted to create a partial section view, that's very simple in SolidWorks. We just begin with a sketch and we only draw a partial segment that doesn't cut all the way through the model. For example, I can draw a vertical line, stop here at the center point, and then I'll just choose my section view command and SolidWorks recognizes the section line doesn't cut all the way across the model and it asks me whether I want this to be a partial section. As I peel the view out to the side, it only hatches the, the portion that's covered by the section line. Now you may want to have a situation where your section line uh, doesn't go all the way through the model, but you'd like to have a portion of the model hatched and the other portion shown unhatched. And the way we can do that is to again draw our, our section line. Here I'll just do a vertical line down through the center of the model. But then I'll draw a horizontal line that goes all the way through uh, and exits out the side of the part. Now I want to pre-select the vertical segment so that when I unfold my section view it projects out to the side. I'll choose my section view command. This time I'll tell SolidWorks I do not want this to be a partial section. And as I project the view, you can see how SolidWorks is hatching only the vertical portion. The rest of the model is shown in the unsectioned state. So two different variations on section on partial sections. One where we show only the hatched area that's being sectioned, one where we show the unsectioned area as well.